All right, so we got really the story of the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Let's go back to the video. Breath of the Wild was a really good game. I'm Bureau. I'm just now getting into Zelda, you know, so that's actually pretty cool. And, um, yeah, man. I Listen, I bet Tears of the Kingdom is going to be absolutely fire. I think it's coming out uh, this May, so. Oh, May 12th, yep. Oh, in two days. Coming out in two days. That's crazy. This is why we're, ca we're catching up on a lot of, uh, we're catching up on a lot of, uh, this is the story Zelda. of our hero, Link, who lost his memories and fought to save the world from the scourge of Calamity Ganon. Yes, sir. Uh, eight's fine. Eight's cool. But yeah, I'm starting to get into Zelda. It began 100 Zelda. years ago in the kingdom of Hyrule. The resurrection of Calamity Ganon was imminent. Zelda, the princess of Hyrule. Zelda! Link, the hero chosen by the legend Link. of the storm that seals the darkness. Look at Link, man, looking all cold. And four champions from each of Hyrule's regions all gathered together and began preparations to put an end to the calamity. I'll protect this land of ours to the death. Hey, why he remind However, me of Christopher Judge? Zelda struggled to awaken her sacred powers to seal the evil. Despite her efforts, Calamity Ganon was resurrected. Straight nuisance. Positive. It's awake. Ganon. Boasting almighty power, Calamity Ganon began his siege. Uh-oh. In the end, the four champions and the king of Hyrule perished. Link was gravely wounded. And the kingdom of Hyrule crumbled to ashes. Dang, man. <laughs> to protect Link from certain death, Zelda finally awakened her powers and was able to seal Calamity Ganon temporarily. Was, was that... Afterward, Link was transferred to the Shrine of Resurrection and put into a deep slumber to heal from his injuries. So make haste and go. His life is now in your hands. That man was slump slump. That man slumped for a hundred years. Wake up, Link. Link awakened to the sound of someone's voice. That kid was asleep for a hundred years. What had transpired? He had no recollection of the past. His memories were lost to time. They put that boy in a hyperbolic time chamber. Hey, Zelda's music hit different. How tall is Link? Do you, uh, he like he like he pushing like four one, four two. Standing before Link was the kingdom of Hyrule, forever transformed. The great calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path. Lo, hey, look at you, man. Ago. Link met with the ghost of the king of Hyrule who had perished during Calamity Ganon's siege. Link also learned that for the past century, Princess Zelda alone was containing the Calamity. Yeah, man, she was, she was thugging it out. You are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. And so, with a mission to defeat the great evil, our hero began his journey across the vast kingdom of Yeah, Hyrule. let's go. Link faced many dangerous foes. Undertook ancient challenges. And befriended new allies. And as he journeyed through Hyrule, he gradually regained his strength. Let's go, Link. As you are I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. 
Yes, sir. Once again, Link wielded the legendary Master Sword. He about to go he dummy. Final battle against Calamity Ganon to restore peace in the kingdom. <laughs> but courage need not be remembered, for it is never forgotten. Strengthened by Zelda's voice, Link challenged the great evil. Now, Link! Now, Link! And after a long struggle, he gained the upper hand. Zelda cast her sacred powers and finally succeeded in sealing Calamity Ganon for good. Rip Bozo, got him out of here. I always thought, no, I always believed. Yeah. That you would find a way to defeat Ganon. I never lost faith in you over these many years. Thank you, Link. Well, it was nothing, you know. The hero of Hyrule. It was nothing. It was nothing, you know. May I ask? Do you really remember me? Of course I remember you. After 100 years, Link and Zelda were reunited at last and began working together to restore Hyrule to its former glory. Yes, sir. Bro, I cannot wait until the new Zelda game drop. Again, I don't know what took me so long. Like to get into Zelda. I'll be real. Again, I've always heard of it. I've always, you know, Zelda was Zelda is Zelda, you know. Um, I've always heard of it. It's just like I never really dove into it. Never really just tried to like, you know, try it. And I honestly, you know, that's that's really was uh like was like a big thing for me. Was, like was because I was so used to like like, you know, liking what I like and not trying like different things. Which you guys shouldn't do mm, I feel like for some people you know, if you like what you like, that's it. But I feel like for most people, the reason they get bored of, of things is because they are so used to just doing the same thing over and over again or liking the same thing over and over again. When, you know, uh, like when it comes down to video games, uh, like a lot of people will say, oh, well, video games is, is drying out, it's dying, this and this and that. Well, you say that, but you play the same three games every day or you play the same game every day. Oh, no, I don't. I actually, I, I actually play this game. No, you don't. Stop. <laughs> Stop, because guess what? If that was the case, you would be bored. If you if you was playing four games a day, four games a day, or five games a day, like like I I don't understand the whole ver like the whole you know take on video games or games. Honestly, me in, in my opinion, I don't feel that way, because at the I no no no, I used to feel that way. I used to, I used to start to think that way. I was like, you know what? I think gaming's getting a little boring. No, it's just because I haven't stepped out the box when it came down to video games, and then you know when I stepped out the box and I tried different video games. That's when it became fun, fun for me again, you know, because I was playing the same two games every day, <laughs> okay? Like, so if you guys feel like, you know, video games are boring or whatever, I mean, obviously, you know, some people, you know, lose passion or or, or, or some people just don't, you know, want to play video games anymore, which is totally fine. I'm not here to, like, you know, make you play video games, but, like, if you really like, you know, playing video games and you feel really bored, try something different. Try something new. It doesn't always have to be Call of Duty, Call of Duty, Call of Duty, or NBA 2K, NBA 2K. Or it doesn't have to always be this same game every single day, all day, every day, because you think that that's the only fun game. No, there are, there are so many different games. It is crazy. So many different type of games. You like, the, uh, brother? Oh my god. Here's my thing, right? For a lot of people that haven't, like, you know, that that feel like gaming is boring, bro. Try playing some games like Detroit Become Human. Try playing uh simple games like uh well, I would say Cuphead. Cuphead isn't really well, Cuphead's a simple game. Um. Try playing, um, you know, some, some challenging games, you know, try playing some, some other different type of games because I was the same way with Zelda. I was like, you know what? Zelda doesn't really sound like my cup of tea. Brother, you don't even know what your cup of tea is. <laughs> That's what I was telling myself. I'm like, bro, wait, hold up. How can I just, just put off Zelda when I don't even know, like, I, I haven't even played it yet. So how can I say that? And now I played it. It was pretty cool, bro. Honestly, bro. On the Switch, it just, I don't know. Just games on the Switch just feel so just... Games that are meant for the Switch on the Switch feel and feel and look really good. Games that are you know that are that are meant for all consoles, but like on the Switch, for instance, right? I remember I played NBA 2K on the Switch. Oh Lord Jesus, I didn't have a good time. 
But when I play Zelda on the Switch or when I play Smash Bros on the Switch, oh man. Oh my god. That thing felt absolutely I, I was on the Switch for hours, bro. Other than that, comment down below. What do you guys think about this? I cannot wait to the uh Tears of the Kingdom to come out. I didn't even know. Again, I forgot. I keep forgetting that it's dropping this May. Uh it's dropping in two days. I'm recording this on uh, on the tenth, by the way. So um yeah, best believe that whenever Tears of the Kingdom come out, yeah, I, I'm getting first dibs, bro. First upload dibs, bro. Other than that, comment down below what you guys think about this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video if you guys want to. Uh, if you guys don't, I'm sorry about that. And uh, I'll see you guys later for the next time I'm out. And